hello guys welcome to this channel and in case you're watching this video for the first time kindly consider subscribing to our channel and uh like the video as well that one is enough we thank you for that for doing so so we've had a lot of um and amount of from the gen z's but um i have seen almost the whole country like let's say 60 percent of the parts of the country they have been demonstrating but something strange is happening in the mulembe nation i think mulembe nation they are very calm they are contented with the government with the current regime because you know their sons are top the top in the ranks you can say musalem Mudawad is a prime minister right now Tangula is a speaker so the people of western they are very silent and these are some of the factors that maybe they are making them silent the people from Lembe nation they have plenty of food if you go to western you find that they live in villages in their villages and each village has a small farm for the family and so these people they are wondering why are you saying that your life is very hard you see people from other parts they can see life very hard but people from western they have whatever it takes to continue living a modest life they don't see any problem whether you raise the taxes you don't raise they are okay they are calm because they have everything number two why they are not protesting uh, the regimes since independent have marginalized this region uh, in a way that you know a lot of they don't have most land like if you go to Transoya county most land belongs to politicians and the people there mostly predominantly bukusus from the Lua, uh, from the luya uh, tribe they are squatters and that if you are a squatter it means you are poor and what poverty means is that uh, you see everything as normal you have if you are poor you cannot think you cannot rise up for your rights you understand so these people they will even celebrate and clap for didmas baraza they will do all those kind of things you can never see maandamano in bungoma county or in Transoya county this is a reality guys and so Mulembe nation they are very calm and they are happy with this government another point is that these people i am from bungoma these people they they have to prove a point because you know the votes from bungoma are the ones that propelled Ruto into power so they must stay put they will not have a reverse gear and say that look Ruto is not doing the, the best thing for this country we voted you and but we are regretting they don't want to take that kind of um, thing to look like they did a mistake so they have to stay put to celebrate whether it goes bad or good they have to keep clapping for Ruto because they have to prove a point so I think that is also another factor and Another fa another thing you should know that uh, Ruto, if you watch the protests very keenly, you will find that in Luo Nyanza and in Western, they have not been so much aggressive of, uh, except maybe Kisum, a lot of big protests. I saw in Migori, but I think those were looters. So Ruto knows very well that the people who will still propel him to power in 2027 are the lawyers and the laws he might play the Raila card and let Raila win the AU chairmanship so that he will garner all the votes of the law Nyanza and Western and as well as his Kalenji and you know where Raila is the people from coast from uh, Trukana they will still vote for Ruto because they are the people of baba whatever baba tells them go this way they follow and so 
you saw the silence of these people because Baba is in is is in the other camp of Ruto. So come 2027, I don't see anyone who can beat Ruto. He will win. Uh, the Luya people, the Luya nation, and the Luo nation, they will back Ruto. And you know what that means? The coast also will have to join and back Ruto. That is the way it is, guys. I don't know which part he will use. But that it is, it is what it is. He will still win the election in 2027 if he reaches that date. Thank you guys. And uh, you can kindly subscribe to this channel if it's your first time here. Just keep click the subscribe button and click the like button. We really appreciate your support guys. Let us hit 5,000 subscribers. Together we can. And thank you for continued support.